Hello everyone, welcome back to ZimStream TV. Your one-stop source for all the latest news, analysis, and commentary on politics, social affairs, and religion. From breaking news to in-depth analysis, we've got you covered. Zimbabweans in Zambia protest against Manungagwa's SARDC chairmanship. A small group of Zimbabwean citizens in Zambia responded to the call for protest today, July 12, by holding banners and demanding action from the Southern African Development Community SADC. The protesters, although few in number, signaled the growing political unrest in Zimbabwe and the need for regional attention to the country's democratic crisis. The protest, initially planned for yesterday, but reportedly blocked by Zambian authorities, saw a handful of Zimbabweans gather in Lusaka, Zambia's capital, to express their discontent. They carried banners with bold messages, including Reverse Manungagwa's SADC Chairmanship and Put SADC SEOM Report on the Agenda. The protesters referenced the SADC Election Observer Mission SEOM, Report which stated that Zimbabwe's 2023 elections fell short of democratic processes. This report has been a contentious issue, with many Zimbabweans and regional observers calling for SADC to take action and address the electoral malpractices. The protest coincided with the ongoing SADC meeting in Zambia, which started yesterday and is expected to conclude today. The meeting has brought together regional leaders and representatives but the protesters in Zambia highlighted the need for SADC to prioritize Zimbabwe's democratic crisis. Although the protest was small, it signifies the widespread discontent among Zimbabweans and the need for regional intervention. The event also highlights the challenges faced by Zimbabweans in exercising their rights to freedom of assembly and expression, both in Zimbabwe and in the region. The protesters' demands are clear. They want SADC to reverse Manungagwa's chairmanship and put the SEOM report on the agenda. They also want the regional body to take concrete steps to address the political unrest in Zimbabwe and ensure that the country returns to a democratic path. As the SADC meeting continues in Zambia, the pressure is on regional leaders to address the political unrest in Zimbabwe and ensure that the country's democratic crisis is resolved. The protesters in Zambia may have been few, but their message is loud and clear. Zimbabweans will not remain silent in the face of political oppression, and SADC must take action to address the country's democratic crisis. The outcome of the SADC meeting in Zambia will be crucial in determining the next steps for Zimbabwe and its people. Will regional leaders heed the call for action and address the political unrest in Zimbabwe, or will they continue to turn a blind eye to the country's democratic crisis? Only time will tell.